this is a really big deal. My prediction is that in this area Optimus will end up being the biggest product ever made. Nothing else will come close. I think it will be 10 times bigger than the next biggest product in history. A humanoid robot could completely reshape human life in ways we haven't even thought about yet. Sure, it could create new kinds of jobs, but let's be honest, it might also replace some. But here's the thing, most people actually want to be less busy and work less. So yeah, there's always some kind of trade-off. Now comes Tesla Optimus, a robot created to help people with daily activities. It can take on a lot of different tasks, as long as it's doing something useful. And of course, the advanced Tesla software powering it is impressive, but what really got everyone talking? The price. A shockingly low price that makes owning a humanoid robot seem actually possible. When Elon Musk announced that Tesla would start selling Optimus next year, people were stunned. So what exactly can this Tesla bot do? And how is it possible that you could get one for just $3,000? Stick around, because if you're thinking about trying to get your hands on a Tesla bot, you'll definitely want to know what's coming. Welcome to Tesla Car World. During the latest Tesla All Hands livestream, Elon Musk made some really bold claims and shared a few ambitious predictions about the humanoid robot project. Now we're not saying everything he mentioned is guaranteed to happen, because well, it's Elon, but some things seem pretty solid. To start with, Tesla is planning to build at least 5,000 Optimus robots this year, but in typical Elon fashion, he casually mentioned that the number could go as high as 12,000. So, things are about to get very interesting. This year, we're hopefully going to make around 5,000 Optimus robots. Technically, we're aiming to have enough parts to build about 10,000, maybe even 12,000. But since this is a brand new product with all new parts and systems, I'll say we're doing well if we reach even half that number. Now, when you hear 5,000 units, your first thought might be, that's it? Or it's satin, there's no way they go past that before running into big problems with production. And that's understandable. But let's look at it from a different angle. Real success isn't just about pushing out massive quantities. It's about actually getting a working production line started and running. And that's exactly what Tesla is doing right now at its Fremont factory. Very few robotics companies have been able to do this. We've all seen tons of humanoid robot demos and prototypes, probably so many that you've lost track. But most of those, they never get past the lab stage. They stay as interesting concepts that never reach real mass production. Almost no companies have taken a humanoid robot from design to actual full-scale manufacturing. That's why Tesla's path stands out so much. Tesla also has something most others don't. The robot has a real AI brain. Like in The Wizard of Oz, it has what it needs to actually function in the real world. Tesla is a leader in real-world artificial intelligence. What they learn from self-driving technology is being adapted for use in Optimus. Plus, Tesla has deep knowledge in electric motors, batteries, power systems, structural design, and most importantly, mass production. That's a combination that gives them a serious advantage over others in this space. Right now, the only other companies we feel confident about in the humanoid robot space are Tesla and Figure AI. Why? Because they have a clear development roadmap and have already built dozens or maybe even hundreds of working robot prototypes. There are others like Unitree, Boston Dynamics with Atlas, and 1X with Neo, and yes, they are impressive. But so far, they haven't shown that they can scale up production. One thing is crystal clear, the race to create and launch a humanoid robot is heating up fast. After watching Tesla's progress with Optimus for quite some time, it's obvious that the company has a major edge when it comes to cost. Elon Musk even said Tesla might be able to build Optimus for just $10,000, which is pretty wild. But wait, what about that $3,000 figure we mentioned earlier? Well, that's not the cost to buy one, that's the yearly rental fee. If you've been following Elon Musk's posts on X, you might have seen where he confirmed that Tesla will offer the Optimus robot both as a rental and for purchase, though renting will come first. Musk said, Ace Boss would be offered both as rentals as well as to buy, but the former first. That sparked tons of talk about what the actual rental price could be. A lot of people believe that if the purchase price ends up being between $20,000 and $30,000, then a fair monthly rental would be around $320 or $30,480 per year. And honestly, that doesn't sound too bad. Renting would let people try Optimus out and see how useful it really is before committing to buying one. But of course, this is still just what people are hoping. The actual price could be higher, especially at launch. In fact, Elon has already said that $20,000 won't be the starting price. So, the first group of Optimus robots might cost $40,000 or even more. What do you think would be a fair yearly rental price for a robot like Optimus? Back to production. 
Like we said earlier, Tesla isn't just making a new product here, they're creating a whole new industry. This isn't like building a new phone or car where you can quickly jump to producing hundreds of thousands or millions of units. This is a humanoid robot, a machine that needs extreme accuracy in every part, every movement and every line of code. Unlike Tesla's electric cars, there is no earlier version of Optimus to improve upon. There's no existing process to follow. Everything, from the way it's assembled to how the AI functions, had to be built from the ground up. So when Tesla says they'll build 5,000 robots this year, and each one will have a completely new, highly advanced hand design, that's a big milestone. According to Elon Musk, the new Optimus hands will have 22 degrees of freedom. That's a very high level of dexterity, meaning the hands can move in many different ways with precision. That alone is a big breakthrough, even more important than just producing a large number. Tesla's next version of Optimus is now in production, and it's learning how to walk and even catch a ball. That's pretty cool. When you see how far they've come in such a short time, it's mind-blowing. From just being an idea, Optimus has turned into what could be the most advanced humanoid robot in the world. This latest version with 22 degrees of freedom might even be able to play the piano. That's impressive. What really makes Optimus different from other robots is how Tesla is thinking. Most companies working on robots focus heavily on making smarter AI or improving how fast the robot walks. But they often ignore one very important thing, the hands. Think about it. Human intelligence isn't just about solving problems or thinking fast. It's also about doing things. And our hands are the most powerful tools we have. Everything we use, buildings, technology, machines, exists because of the things our hands can do. Tesla understands that. That's why Optimus isn't just built to be smart. It's also designed to be extremely capable. With hands that work almost like ours, Optimus could be the first robot that actually performs tasks like a human. That's a huge step toward making AI useful in the real world. This one feature could be what separates Tesla from every other company in the humanoid robot race, and it could be the thing that truly brings robots into our daily lives. Believe it or not, the hand design might make up nearly half of the engineering in Optimus. Elon Musk even said that from an electromechanical view, the hand is about half the work. So those 5,000 Optimus robots? They're not just some number, they're the foundation of something much bigger. Like laying the first stones for a pyramid, this number represents Tesla's shift from being just a car company to leading the charge in humanoid robotics. Today it's 5,000, tomorrow it could be 50,000, then 500,000, maybe even more. Because if Tesla has shown us anything, it's that they always find a way to surprise the world. Need proof? They build a Model Y every 35 seconds. That's insane. And during the latest live stream, Elon dropped another unbelievable claim. He said Tesla could eventually manufacture a car in just five seconds. Yup, you heard that right, five seconds. Imagine a fully built car coming off the line every five seconds. That's next level. It may start slow in year one, but once Tesla gets moving, nobody can catch up. And Optimus will be no different. Producing 5,000 robots in a year means each one takes about one hour and 45 minutes to complete. That's already pretty amazing. Elon even joked that 5,000 Optimus bots would be about the size of a Roman legion. That's kind of a scary thought, right? A whole legion of robots. But Elon said, I will literally build at least one legion of robots this year. And probably 10 leg. 